we all should be celebrating our quinceañera. We are 15. Really great teachers always helping you out. It feels like a family. And that's something that I think defines Camino is the relationship between students and teachers. We're showing that we're agents of social change. I'm Philip Lance and I'm the co-founder of Camino Nuevo Charter Academy. 30 years ago I began my career as an Episcopal minister in an Echo Park. And so gradually I began building a sort of a network of relationships in the neighborhood, sort of floating this idea of building some kind of a community which eventually became known as the Pueblo Nuevo community. And then June of 1993 we started meeting in MacArthur Park. When we started the Mass in the Grass with 20 or 30 people coming and sitting on blankets. And then fast forward to when we had our first Caminata event where kids and parents from all our schools sort of all came in and converged on the park over at the band shell. So it was really exciting to see, you know, compare Mass in the Grass in 1993 to the new Mass in the Grass in 2014. By 1999, we had a good number, I don't know, several hundred people involved in Pueblo Nuevo in various ways from the community. And one of the big issues that especially the parents uh, were concerned about was education. Kind of saw, wow, what if our little neighborhood in MacArthur Park could have a charter school? What a great way to sort of take control of education, really get the parents involved in helping build the school, which is what Camino Nuevo has been about ever since. How do we deliver you know, a blue ribbon, gold medal, pro educational program to, to this community that's never had such an educational program before. So, of course, that was very ambitious to, to think you could run a public school when we were this little grassroots um, organization running a thrift store and a janitorial company. So this is where it helps to be an idealist and to believe in people and what people can do working together and believe in parents and believe in kids. We opened our doors in 2000 right away with hundreds of students who wanted to be at our school. I think the first years of Camino Nova's lives were uh, years that were full of potential, uh, full of opportunity, and full of hope. Mi nombre es Ana Fabiola Ponce Cheveste, and I am the CEO of Camino Nuevo Charter Academy. And I grew up on Burlington, literally 10 blocks from where the school is. You know, growing up in Pico Union is difficult. It, it, it's not even just about what happens in your home, it's a lot about what happens outside of the home. And what's important to us is that we see all of our kids and, and families as individuals, and they all have a story. I mean, just to walk on campus, it, it, it feels like Camino Nuevo and it's all very personalized. So fundamentally, there's the ethic of care that just is threaded throughout everything that we do and very much connected to that is our commitment to moral leadership. And so we define our success together. It's not just the schools, but it's also the kids and the families. We often get comments from visitors who will say, who will be like surprised, like it seems so happy there. And you know, if you can create a happy school, you know, you've done so much. Happy and rigorous. <laughs> yeah. That's Anna. That's why we need Anna here. I'm so excited for the next 15 years. I mean, just to start to see all, all our alumni come back and just, you know, the care that that they take to stay in touch and their willingness to come and mentor. What I hope for the future is that the solid very good educational program we've created so far can just get better and better so we can become a national model of how to educate English language learners in an impoverished community environment and I think that would be really exciting to see that we can create not only a program of academic rigor but also a program that addresses all the components of being a human being. And I think those are the kinds of students we want to be educating and producing. That's, that's our educational product that we want to be giving back to this community and to, to Los Angeles. Thank you.